Dong Ah. I have a midterm presentation in around 10 minutes. Update the presentation went well. I think it could have gone a little better. I was really nervous. Right now, I'm going to head to the grocery store. Origami time. I feel like I should know this. <laughs> and then, no, wait, isn't it like this? Open it up like this. Right? Oh, I just came into my room and started folding stuff. Uh, one lap joint, one miter joint, like in the wood shop, and then 3D print two joints. I just did this. I just went here. Is that bad? <laughs> it's not like, supposed to get like, because it said bad. fold and unfold to crease. I thought you'd be good at this. Don't tell anyone we're our students. <laughs> Maybe it's our fault. <laughs> so sad. This looks terrible. Rose. <laughs> Thank you. How good are you? Are you free? Nah, this is a really useful technique. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Give me a few more seconds. Crease this like this, right? Yeah. So, instead reverse fold means you open it up. Oh. You fold it upwards, can you squash it? We open it up first, but then we fold up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you open it up and upwards and then close it. Oh, open it and then... Yeah, oh, okay. I see. Ah, thank you. scene project that I need to be doing so we're gonna head to the studio and get that done apparently there's gonna be a storm these next two days I think <laughs> brighter it's raining terribly outside my plan is that i'm going to go to bergen bagels i'm gonna pick up some breakfast and then we're gonna go to the student union to do more work i think my camera is foggy somewhere okay let's head over to breakfast presentation for tomorrow we have to do a pitch for our class and we're all gonna present and then at the end the class is either gonna split into two or we're gonna have a class 
project, my pitch, I chose an organization called the Wild Bird Fund and this is what I have so far. I need to get it done before tomorrow. Not done with this presentation. I think I'm gonna add some graphics on the side to decorate according to the style and then this is my concept and my premise so I wanted to highlight what my motives for this presentation. My mood board totally took a lot of stuff from Pinterest. Character design, fun is just like the brush textures and color palette of what I envision the final thing to be. I still need to draw another background for this. I'm currently on frame three for my storyboard. Got quite a bit of do tonight. I made progress on my storyboard. So far I have like five frames. Setting the scene, I have a row of a lot of people and then in the corner you can see our little pigeon. The pigeon's injured. This is our main character. There's supposed to be a lot more people but I just haven't gone around to it. I want this to be like a fish eye style frame so you're kind of looking down at him. So our main character will enter in the frame after this is established and then he'll kneel down while people pass by. The idea is that he's gonna show the audience on what to do when he encounters an injured bird which is to pick it up carefully and then bring it to the wild bird fund which is the facility in New York City. That is my storyboard in progress. Thank you! What'd you get? Darjeeling. Yeah. And then this is jasmine milk tea. Yeah. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Probably. We <laughs> live in the best life. Crying with Goba. <gasps> oh my god! Oh. <gasps> <laughs> Look at us. Wait, can you even see it on camera? Yeah, wet one too. I took a lot. <laughs> <laughs> defined and closed off and not inclusive so now i'm trying to make it more open with like planes open walls so it's not like this is enclosed space this is interior this is exterior that's so cool that's my site this is roosevelt avenue cool <laughs> the zoom call it was to talk about a little anniversary video that i need to do some animations on but that's for later right now i'm back on working on my pitch and my plan was to color these in but i'm just gonna do them sketch later because i do not have time critiques in the world didn't make those things finished my compositing class. I'm still in the room because I'm gonna be working on some other assignments. This compositing class, we are doing a title sequence. I still don't really know what I'm going for, but yeah, I'm just really excited. I have class at six, so I'm gonna probably chill here until then and work on a lot of homework. Quite spontaneous. I'm actually heading over to Joyce's place. I was feeling pretty overwhelmed with work and I texted her. So you can come over and we can work together. So that's what I'm gonna do. Carly! <laughs>
and it's gonna be a really cold night. Hold on. He's got a scent. Charlie, are you gonna poop? Don't go yet. So before I left Joyce's place, I wrapped it in plastic and then put it in here. Thankfully, it didn't get wet because it has my iPad and then my hard drive, my computer, and my converter. It's a good hack if you're about to go into rain. Right now, I'm actually going to go to a cafe with Amy. It's currently 8.13 in the morning. Honestly, this past week, I haven't gotten a lot of sleep at all. I've been getting six hours five to six hours. Last night I got home at like 11.30, went to bed at 12, and now it's eight, eight hours of sleep last night, which is so amazing. I'm ready to have a grand session with Amy. I'm working on this title sequence project and it's so fun. 